I am out here looking for bees and I decided this is a good place for a flower farm because obviously there's flowers everywhere and there's also these I would call them high-end flowers corn flowers and and these babies here but back in these woods somewhere there's lily of the valley and a bee another bee yeah here's some now where the bees are I still don't know let's go down here right here so it's nighttime we're gonna go ahead and get these bees I've got another one got three at home now I've got two I think one's in here and I've got some flowers put in here too yeah bees nest bees nest those flowers but I'm getting ready to do a flower shifting farm time lapse. So we'll find a bed and we'll cut to that. Yeah, I see you. This is out by the mansion, obviously. There's one house up here and a whole village down there, so I'm taking over this house. I'm kind of far out. I've been looking for snowy mountains, and they must not exist in this world. Well, they probably do. They're just really rare and really far away. I'm a couple thousand blocks out, but I found this. I'm going to look for a goat horn in there and maybe kill a flag bearer so I can trigger a raid back home. Let's give it a go. One down. I'll take that. Dang it, nothing good. Nothing good. Got it. Okay, I'm going to fly back home and see what happens. Open. Nothing. Golem. This is the right way. No more LAs there.
yeah, I'm over here by that new city, new ancient city. And I came through the nether here. We'll just go back through, show you. Got this in my inventory. I built a flower farm, showed everybody how to do that real quick. A movable, I mean, you gotta tear it down. and build it up. You can see the fortress is right there. Where I was at, as you come through here, where I put carpets down, go under the staircase and I mark my way. Sometimes stuff spawns right here. Oh boy. And now I need to eat. Run. Run. I changed swords. I went back to my sharpness. Um, mostly because it's better at everything except for stuff like this. Whoa. I like to be able to one shot these guys though. Okay, <laughs> stuff spawns right there. Could be your worst nightmare. So anyway, I marked my way here too. And bam, here's the portal to the ancient city. But yeah, I built up a flower farm. I was talking about YouTube in general. Um, I know the Minecraft community lost a big, big YouTube Minecraft guy who passed away. And I won't even mention his name, but it. I was pretty sure that uh, a few weeks ago they uh, they kind of turned on the algorithm for even smaller YouTubers on Minecraft content. And I had that for about a week. And was doing, you know, I got to see what it's like, and you know, I was getting five hundred over five hundred views and getting comments and getting likes and getting uh, subscribers. Um, Overall, I gained about a fourth of the sub subscribers I already had, which I don't have very many. I don't get that many views, but I got to see what it's like. And so if that's the case, that's fine. Otherwise, they're just messing with little guys and they're hiding them away. And um, the other option is just too crappy of videos. Nobody wants to watch crappy videos. They want to watch highly produced, you know, uh, people playing with groups, stuff like that. But not necessarily. Um, the main thing is that what I'm going to do is try, since I got to see what it's like, hit the algorithm. I'm going to try to put out a video, one video per day, and just go down here into the city and see what happens. See if we can find a sneak book. Yes, baby. We've got chests. So, got something over there to deal with. Oh, okay. It didn't set it off. I don't know how. Can I go downstairs without it? I'm just sneaking, but... Oh, boy. Sneak past this. So, hopefully, if I take that out, that's the only one around here. And I'll be alright. We're gonna find out real quick. Use the hoe. Nope. There was another one. Warden approaches. Cool. Took care of that. Now I'm safe for a little bit. Really hard to hit candles. And hope for the best on that. Power three sneak. Yeah, the three book. Get all that book. Take all the books. All right, let's move on and get some wool where we're at it. We have swift sneak two, which is pretty good. I'm noticing. So we want to go over here and start stealing the wool. That's what I want to do. This is for running later <laughs> when all this solid. Uh -oh. 
took him out. Chests. Are there any chests up there? Probably. So, where's another chest? Right over there. Is that where I just was? No. Sneak land for the win. Yeah, this sneaky pants stuff is good. Taking you out. All right, that was easy. Here we got. Maybe I can just fly. I think I set off something. Sneaky landed. I can't remember if there's a uh, chest up there or not. Should be something over there. There's two of them here. That worked. That worked. Nice. All right, here we go. This fragment, okay. Uh oh. Gordon draws close. Yeah, I set stuff off several times now by flying. It's the rockets that set them off, nothing else. And I don't know where I came in at, so that's great. He's around here. Gonna die. Uh oh. I failed again. Failed again. There he is. There's two of them now, but. Yep, I like Swift Sneak. Not that I used it well. I like it though. Technically, I shouldn't have set off anything. I used it right. Sun rays. I guess you could call them. Uh oh. <laughs> find out we're good right aha there's just one we're gonna try it yes whatever
was right down there where I set everything off, wasn't it? like a bad area it was it was a bad area Come on, idiot. Huh? You mad? Stuck over there. That's that way we know we've been here. This is the water we want to go up. Here. And then right here. We made it. I did much better. That thing had wide open aisles, and if you can just run far enough out of his, out of his, uh, sight, or he, he can't see, so. Out of his hearing and smell, you're good. And that's what I did, so. Go back through and call this a day. We got Swift Sneak 3, but I really wanted another one book, if I could add it to the one book that I have, and not waste the three book. There might be more stuff in there. Right now, I've got so much stuff to put away. <laughs> Samuel Aberg, number five. Recovery compass. Bam! That thing is looking cool. I don't know where the last place I died is, but what's it pointing at? At me? Put that up there, baby. Spin around and around. We do have a disc. You guys have heard it. Creepy disc. Play this on my way out. Just a little bit, and then we'll hear some more. In the beginning of the next video. So I'm going to try this one video a day for the forthcoming future, and we'll see if anybody can watch. If anybody gets notified. If anybody gets recommended. If it comes up in search engines. If you're watching, go ahead, hit like, hit dislike. Say something, subscribe. Um, there was a question I was going to ask. If I were to upload daily, what time of the day would you like? A video to pop up. Give me a time of the day you like videos to come on that you have the most time. Leave that comment and I'll see you in the next video. We went from creepy weird disc to uh, calming music and I don't know where it's going to go from there. We'll find out in the next video. See you then. Is it over? No. Bye bye.